We are very honored to have a <laughs> pot tonight on our show. <laughs> this is actually a dish. I mean, this dish is much better than looking at me. I mean, Ramy is better to look at than <laughs> Ramy made this dish. It's an amazing dish. Ramy, welcome to AHA, which stands for a human among humans. Oh, yes. I like that. And, and Ramy likes that, which is good. But we're now going to, but we're, we're going to fade away, right? Because in, when in the presence of great art, mm -hmm. who cares who people are? Look at that. Look at that. I mean, that's a, so tell us a little about this pot. What moved you to make them? Where we can see more of them? Well, I am a potter at Mudflat Studio in Somerville. And I work with porcelain. It's a very fine English china clay. You tell me a little bit more about porcelain, because I've heard of porcelain. I thought it was almost like an element, like, um, you know, like steel or iron. That's not true right. at all. No, porcelain's a clay body, and there's stoneware, which has see, a this lot is of iron See, this is it. a fancy show. It's not just clay. <laughs> it's a clay body. It's a clay body. Yes. And um, it's which porcelain. Which means, what's the difference between a clay body and clay? Well, clay, we call it a clay body. Boy. It's the kind of clay that it is. Oh, it's a clay body. Oh, yes. and other clays. Oh, I see, because it can't just be clay. Well, so porcelain is very white. It has no iron in it. So oh, it's very white and very fine. And it comes so from the earth? It comes from the earth. Uh, oh, it's like if you went to, yes. the, went to the backyard, you can dig up some mm, porcelain? It depends on your backyard. But if, you, if, if it's a certain backyard, you can have mm, porcelain in your backyard? Possibly. Wow. Possibly. I wouldn't go digging in the backyard if I were you. Yes, but, but um, so people in Cambridge, um, as wonderful as we think of ourselves, we don't have porcelain in our backyards. Probably not. But in China, I have we would? porcelain in my lab. In my, oh, because you get, get it sent from China? <laughs> We get it sent b by various clay suppliers, and I never really bothered to find out exactly where it comes from. Oh. But it's very fine clay, and I like to use it. Yes. Because I like a white, it's kind of like my three-dimensional canvas. So yes. I paint on it. I love decorating my pots. I use very simple forms, and I decorate them. And I started doing cats. You can see it's kind of the essence of a cat. Yes. Um, it's not, it's not like, really a cat. Well, That's it is. Not. You can see the claws and the whiskers. And oh, where's the claws? The claws, the claws are, are, I would say, right here. Claws. Oh. And um, on the underside of it, there is a cat. Oh, my. On the bottom. This is amazing. Yes. This is really great art. Well, thank you. I really think it is. <laughs> thank you. And you've and seen her here. And she's really not. Good. And she's <laughs> not selling for, you know, thousands of a plate yet, right? Right. But this I, could be, this could be in this very difficult economic times, the best investment you'll ever make. It could be a good investment. Yes. And it makes your food taste really good. Are you, it can go in the this? oven. Oh yeah, it can go in the oven, the dishwasher, the microwave. No kidding. Wow. I'd be so mm -hmm. afraid I, br I bought one salad bowl, not as beautiful as this, and broke it. Well, I mean, you know, it is it, Isn't porcelain like very, clay. very easy to break? It's clay. I mean, if you drop it, yeah, it will drop break. It, yes. Oh. Yeah. One of those. Um, not like, not like um, plastic. Right. Not like plastic. Uh, mm -hmm. So it will break if you drop it. However, it's very it's porcelain is a very strong clay body. Yes. And um, it makes your food taste really good. Is that really true? It's really true. Yes. yes it makes your food taste good. Oh, I thought that was like a <laughs> a, um, a selling point, but. It really makes your food well. It taste makes your food taste good because when you're eating out of something that's handmade, especially yes. if you know the artist. Oh my! Then it makes it really I, wonderful. I, I'm, I'm refraining from certain <laughs> kinds of responses there, which I will not say it because this is this is family television. But um, <laughs> and don't you think that either? You and I'm talking about you. Stop <laughs> thinking that. This is a, this is an artistic show. This is high art. And if you want to know why I put cats on my some of my work. It's because my sister really loves cats, and she had six of them, and I made a platter for her. And people told me, why don't you put cats on your work? And I bet oh, people would love them. But it's really beautiful. It's a beautiful painting. Oh, thank it's you. Very, it reminds me of Paul Clay. Oh, that's or, wonderful. It that is really an honor. It, it, I mean, that it's is fun. An honor. It's very interesting. Well, people those, often... Because those, those eyebrows also look like mountain peaks. Well, I actually thought they were ears. Oh. Those are the cat's ears, but they could be eyebrows they also. Be I eyebrows, like that. Yes. I like that interpretation. And they could be um, 
boomerangs? Oh, I, no, I don't think so. For no? That, I don't think so. But, uh, and no. that could be, those whiskers could be an ocean. It's very could be. interesting. Could be. So, I mean, w what would make you worth like like the famous artists? Like, are some, some people who make pots sell them for like thousands of dollars? Is that true? Some are, people do. The who's famous the fa potters. Who's the famous potters beside uh, that? And now he or her, she has a famous name. Ramy Gold. I mean, if you that's want to think, pretty famous. that's very. It's a beautiful name. Oh, thank you. I'll it's tell not you. like Ramy um, <laughs> Aluminum or something like that. You know, right, or, gold. Right, Ramy Gold. Not even silver. Right, Ramy Gold. gold. Yeah. I wish I could tell my parents. And what is your middle name? Anne. Ramy and Anne means great, Ramey graceful. Anne. And what does Ramy mean? I don't know. I don't know. My f parents uh, found the name in a French novel. Do they make fun of you? Like they sing the song. Re do what do yes. you, they do that to you? When I Ray was younger, they did. Yes, because I always say Raymi like Joe Raymi. Here's Raymi. Yes. Ray. Yeah. What, what did they say? Oh, do Raymi, do Ray. Oh, do Ray. Here's do Raymi. Yeah. Oh, I see anything. But that's okay. That's okay. It's musical. Yes. It's very musical. But this really might be in these hard economic times. I can see it now. But then I would just put it away. I'd be afraid to use it. Well, no, it's, you, it's very important to, to use my work because yes. all my work is functional. I do functional things. I have some other things here. If I can, We can look at them if you'd like. Oh, that are not functional. Oh, that are, that are oh, functional. Everything oh, I do is functional. It's so hard to let go of this cat, though. But maybe we can come back to it? We could come back to the cat. And, yeah. and, and this is a, a bowl. It's, oh, I like Oh, you This is like kind of a flatter bowl. Like it would, be, would it be sacrilegious to put, feed my cat in this? No, I think your cat might really like that. Yes? Yeah. It's that would be very nice for your oh. cat. I'd love wow. to see your cat using that. But oh it does, my. it can go in the oven. It can go in the dishwasher. And how do you make it? I take some clay, I wedge it. Yeah, and so then we're going well, to show, we're going to now look at these famous hands, folks. I, do that wedge feeling. I take the clay. I have very big, strong hands. Yes. And um, I wedge the clay. Yes. And then I put it on the potter's wheel. And I, for a plate like this, I would use a bat, which is a circle so that I can take the whole And you can put your hands higher out. so people can see these oh, strong hands. Okay. Yes. Very strong hands. G give me it's your hand. To yes. There, <laughs> that where they That's go. there. Here we go. And up there. Very strong potter hands. Don't lose. Don't lose. Oh, don't there, lose yeah, there you there are. Go. Yes. <gasps> yes. Look okay. at that. Strength. Okay. And, so, but show us um, to do the show that again. So you wedge it. <laughs> what does wedging mean? You wedge it. You take the air bubbles out. It's kind of like kneading bread. Yes. You take the air bubbles out because you don't want air bubbles in your. And you do clay. with your hands. None of this. None of the mechanical taking it right. You you just you squeeze them out with your hands. You push it on a wedge. And you have table. like a real sensual relationship with the cl with yeah, the. Yeah, I do. Yes. And as I'm wedging the clay, I visualize what I'm making. Oh my! I visualize what I'm going to make, and then when it's all wedged into a little ball, then yes. I like it. Put it on the bat, which is on the potter's wheel. Yes. And then I sit at the wheel and I start to center the clay. You really need to center the clay so that it doesn't wobble. Yes. So you want it centered, and, and then. And if you're using your hands up higher, so we can all benefit okay, from these. So you're this way. <laughs> you're centering the clay. Yes. <laughs> and then when you have it centered, and I for a platter, I have to make it flat and low. Yes. So what I do is I kind of hold my arm and I put my arm on it. So we have the arm is sitting on the clay to flatten it. Oh, while it's spinning. While it's spinning. Oh, yes. It sounds wonderful, exciting. Yes. No it's very like exciting. It. You'll yes. have to come over and see it. Yes. I'll give you a demo. Yeah. And do people come to see? Or people where's, can where's, come where's to your, Mudflat. Where is Mudflat? Mudflat is at 149 Broadway in Somerville, and when, we have classes. So where is 149 Broadway? It's near McGrath Highway. Oh. Right near McGrath Highway. I it's a couple of blocks from McGrath Highway. Oh, yes. We have so wonderful classes. Yes. Our classes start um, the end of April for the spring, no, the spring summer semester. I once took a class. Well, you can take well, another yes, class. I, yes, I, Get hooked I on clay. That'll no, keep you no, out I of trouble. Some, uh, uh, <laughs> we, we won't, we, we, I'm, I'm going to not go there, although it would okay, be very interesting. Okay, we won't go there. Okay, so hold it. So you, you, so this mm -hmm. is, this is on and you're making it flat, so you're pushing it down? We're pushing it down. And yeah. how does it turn into a to a to this beautiful? Oh well, then is this I, called a dish. What is this called? It's called a plate. A plate. A plate or a platter. Or a platter. Yeah, yes. or a platter kind but of it's, bowl. But you could really eat your granola in the oh, morning. Oh, you could. Yeah, it's a lot of granola in that. Uh, I, but I eat a lot of granola. Yes. Okay. A well, then you could use yes. that. Right. And um, you, then you put a hole in the middle of this flattened piece of clay, and you open it. You pull it open. Yes. And then um, you. 
kind of flatten hands up it. so we can see you these flatten it. amazing you have to flatten hands. It. This is our big chance. <laughs> and you take, and I usually gonna, take her. Feel, <laughs> feel this in the audience. Like, take these hands in. Your hands might make beautiful things, too, if you really take it in. Yes, Yes. come to my foot. Take yes. a class. <laughs> yeah, well, no, maybe we might just get it get it from watching the DVD. Watch, you could. You it's can watch possible. this on, yes. If you, if right. you missed this, you can go to michaelcoran.blip.tv. <laughs> maybe we'll put this up if you're lucky. But this might be your, or if we don't, this is your only chance. So you better pay attention. Okay, so, yes. So then you open it up and you bring up the walls. You open it up. You bring up the walls oh. like this, and you smooth it out. And, and you must really be doing because it's 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 so symmetrical. Well, you have to know what you're doing. So I mean, it's not like uh, when I made them; they had all kind of different shapes. Well, right. And then after like oh maybe a couple of days later, when it's sufficiently dry, it comes off the bat, and then you take it and you flip it over and you um, you trim. With the trim tool, you trim this little um, foot here, and then I like to decorate it with another cat. You see, th you don't get, this is not just a plate mm -hmm. on, with decorated beautifully on one side. This is two artistic two creations for the price. Yes, let's turn it. Let's, let's, we have two paintings and in one. And so you're really, you're really painting. And yes. How do you paint this with your fingers? Or I with paint what? it with a paintbrush, a wonderful paintbrush that I have. Oh my! And um, I have skinny brush for the whiskers and a fatter brush. And are for are the you ears stuck? Is it is it like um, watercolor? Once you do it, that's it. You can't like re. Well, you can. I mean, you can if, put play, you, if you don't like it, you can. If I don't like it, I can take a damp sponge and, and wipe it off. But you usually yes. apparently it sounds like you don't do that usually. Well, when I when I'm painting, I like get very zen, focused. This is like a zen paint. You just it's very do it. Zen. And, and, and I you breathe. Don't have and get the strokes to go to fluid. And you don't even have a cat fluid. to watch, right? You just no, you I don't remember watch the, cat. the essence it's of cat. The essence of the cat. And these are different. These are two very. They're different. It's hard to remember, but they look a little alike. They're very. Well, they're all different. They're it's all almost very a landscape. It really looks like it's a. Just home. the essence of a cat. Wow. Yeah. So you can do the essence of people. Uh, sometime I I do some movement gestures on some of my work. I didn't bring. Well, I. Did, I can't come um, to you and say, "Could you please make a plate of me." Oh, uh, well. So be, I'd like to be a platter. Isn't there a we, song? We could try that. I'd rather be a platter than a plate. No, is that, no, no, it's not, no. It's not a song. She's, she's kind. She's not, only, she's not only a good potter, she's kind enough to laugh at very bad jokes. That's why we like. Okay, so it's hard to say goodbye to this, but there's other things we need. Is there more you want to sell? Well, no, I, this is fine. I mean, I have more of these at my studio. We have open studio. Oh, but so you have more like this. Yes, I have more like this but at my studio. But it's not the same, though. Well, right. no, they're one of a kind. They're one of a kind. Each painting is one of a ah, kind. This is amazing. Yes. yes. So, and I have more at my studio. We have open studio the first weekend in May, May 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. That's, yes. And you are invited. Thank you. Friday night is our opening with wine and cheese and food. And food. May 1st. Food. Food. Yes. Good food. And, and what time is this? Cooks. It's from 6 to 10 Friday night. It's a long time. Yes, so yes. you have a lot of time to And you come, come to, and, and this is at, where is it this again? This is Mud Flat, 149 Broadway what, in near, Somerville. Off near the McGrath Highway, yes, I used to know. Right, Broadway. right near McGrath Highway. Oh, and the Star Market's down there, right? Yes, yes. it's near the Star Market. Yes, I am, yes. yes. Uh, over, over Winter Hill. Yeah, yes. it's the other side yes. of Broadway. Yeah, I understand. The other side of McGrath Highway, And other actually. people who are showing or just you? Oh, it's, oh, oh, a lot of people. Not just you? No, lots no, of people. No, wouldn't know, but they can't be as good as you. No. Well, it's, it's totally Did they have, like, the best? Is there a place, like, for the, for the you mm -hmm. wouldn't like? No. Okay, but these... So you'll come and you'll see it. Uh, uh, I, and so will you. You will all come yes, we'll, to we'll, Open Studio. It's part of Somerville Open Studio, and you can come to Mudflat. Oh, you can go to other Open it's Studios. It's like a museum. Right? We just it's go like watch. a museum. Yes, yes. Uh, yes, and sometimes people are doing demonstrations of throwing pottery. It would be very interesting to see the the different ones of this. Yes, I have several of that those. That would be interesting, but we're not, but yes. not this show, because we're now going to say goodbye. Do you have names for these? No. This is cat platter. Oh, this is cat platter. Mm -hmm. Blue, so blue it's a, cat. It's an platter. amazing gift to anyone yes. who has cats. Yes. It's a wonderful gift for people who have cats. Yes, I, I, I'm not yes. selling this. I'm just. Because I, I, this is just priceless anyway. I, well, yes. thank you. Yeah, I really think this is um, beyond, beyond, it, well, you know, like, like, like Picasso. Oh, okay. thank now, this you. Is you hard are to, so kind. No, I'm not kind. You are so kind. People, you know me. He's a very wonderful I am not person. kind at all. <laughs> no, I've got, you know, but any, I'm telling the truth. Okay, now this is hard to appreciate on, this is much more beautiful, unfortunately, in person.
Yes, it, it doesn't. It quite, is better in person. Yes. This Why don't is we bring it close bowl. to us? See what happens when you just bring it to our? This is a small. Oh, I think bowl. you. Oh, I think you can feel it. It, feel, it looks def better this way. I yeah. Think. Oh yeah. Yeah, you can way see the better. It's very no, but it has a certain sacred quality to me. Oh, that's so nice, Dave. Very. You know. It's a copper red glaze, which is very hard to get. These are fired in a reduction kiln. To 2,400 degrees Fahrenheit. Boy, I, I better be on your good side when you I visit the studio. There's flames yeah. shooting yeah. out of the kiln. It's very dramatic. Would this be like a perfect crime? To uh, put someone in there and then put and put them in in a big pot? There, no, it, it would be hard. Someone in a would big you, pot? I, I mean, understand. if you put a person in this kiln, what would happen to them? At 2,400 degrees? Yes. Cremated. And then you and then you also oh, this is a perfect crime. And then you could take the ashes and put them in. Oh. Oh, you can yes. throw the ashes on the yeah. pot. So yeah. if you have someone you don't particularly care for, May 1st to... No, no. That, you see, I told you I wasn't kind. That's well, an extraordinary, I thought he was a kind person. Extraordinarily <laughs> unkind. That just came out. And I, anyway, yes. so this is mm. part of my red series, the copper red glazes. Oh, so it sounds like you're like one of these famous people, like my blue series. <laughs> yeah, right. Yes, right. So you, here you are being humble, but we know what... Oh, see, it's anyway, so this makes your food taste really good. I have many more of is them. Is that really true? Oh, yes. You, when you, you're you, eating out of a handmade piece yes? of pottery, food tastes really good. I'd feel very shy. I'm not sure I would eat. I would not sure... If I had this... I wouldn't be sure I deserve to eat, you, you know. You deserve to eat. No, after that last remark, this plate well, wouldn't even Well, that wasn't a great remark, but... Yes, yeah, see? You no, know, you're a good person. <laughs> you deserve a piece like that. It's very beautiful. I, could, well, we see, I don't think you. we can see the inside. Oh, yes, you can. Look at that. It's like a star inside. Yeah, it's purple. It's a purple glaze yes, called sir. Heaven's Gate. Yes, and that's who you could be. <laughs> you could be at Heaven's Gate. I'm not sure we you would get at Heaven's into Gate, Heaven. Right? But we'd be Would they in, let you in? Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. Sh no. Sure, one of they my. They let you in. They let me in. Yeah, I would write you a good heaven. recommendation. I, oh, I see. I need your help. I think <laughs> this, this, this would be. This is heaven. This is. Re it almost feels like they're angels floating around in there. Oh, I like that. They do look like angels, don't These they? Are, so, what do you eat in this, though? This is anything you like, want. And I, I, I wouldn't dare put it in my dishwasher. It would get. Oh, chipped. it goes to the dishwasher. It's fine. Wouldn't it get chipped? I, I, if see, you're careful. Yes, I see. For chipped. someone like me, it would careful. be. Careful. It would be like sacrilege to take. I say I would, but these are really special. And so, what do you eat? It's like soup. I do soup, salad, um, anything I or eat, yes. oatmeal. These are great gifts to people rice, that 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 wouldn't pasta. break it the way I would, right? Someone who's careful, like my brother. Well, you know, you have to be careful when you're using. This pottery. is a nice manage. I I'm a, I'm a adjuster of the piece. This would be a nice gift. For people who have everything but Are don't you have. Are of the pink? Yes. So oh. if anybody wants to get oh. married, yes. Exciting. Oh. I'll marry you. It's good to know. Thank you. Wow. It's nice to know. This is really. It feels delicate too, more delicate than the stuff I am used to. Well, my pottery, I like to make thin pottery, and it does feel much lighter and more delicate than other pottery. Oh, this would be like a religious ceremony, <laughs> like in the name of the right. In the name, this is Passover. We can say. Yeah. It. Right. An Easter's coming. Why is this bowl different from all the other yes, bowls? Yes, why is this? And this bowl is different than all other bowls. And well, we I do have more herb. of those bowls, unfortunately. But I, unfortunately. I'm really interested in looking at the difference between them. Okay. Even though, they're, right, because they're all made, this is not mass produced. No, they're all made by these hands. And you take a long time. How, does it, how long does it take to make one of these? Well, you know, it's a whole process. You know, wedging the clay, and then you throw the piece, and, and then you so have to trim it. it's a lot of work. And this piece has a very deep foot on it. So that takes a long time to trim and to create. So these are fancy words that right. people in Cambridge would get. I, I don't They're get smart. Some, what they would know What does deep foot mean? It sounds a like. deep foot. It has a foot. It's deep. That's as not opposed look, that to. That doesn't look like a foot to me. That looks like the base of a. Of a well, the base. We call the base of a pot. A foot? A foot. It we call like the rim of, of a pot the lip. That I can get. The lip I can get. Yeah, the foot I, I didn't know. It doesn't look like a lip at all, but we do call it a lip. That, that I knew, though. But big yeah. foot, none of us knew that. Big foot. So yeah. we were. So we're, I do big foot. We're pieces. leaving. And, and this, is a, this is not just your name, this is what it's called. Is that true? People in, in the right, pottery world will know this is we called. We call it a foot. A big, and, this, and this is a big foot because? Well, it's just a big foot because I like, I like my pots to stand no, up. No, I mean, what it makes it a big foot? The way I trim it. And tell me more. I mean, I, I, I... Well, I leave a lot of clay on the bottom. Here, you mean? Yeah, before I trim it. And then I have a lot of clay that I can trim off, so I can make it a deep 
deeper foot I mean, so that it stands up straight. I still don't And it's lifted slow, off of the table. Oh, so there's a little base here. Yeah. You can see. So it oh. kind of lifts off the table. Oh, and, and so Bigfoot means this part is the Bigfoot part? Yeah. Oh, I, I see. All right. Yeah. This looks extreme. I mean, it yeah. really looks like I should be a religious person. I well, should you be, probably are. I could drink out of this. That would be well, almost... Well, you could, but you, it might be better if you drank out of this. No, that would be well, hard. I don't know. That, that would be that, very hard to drink out of. You could drink out of that. No. This oh, is oh, another is that, copper is that, is that for, is, is, that for, is that for drinking? That's for drinking. It's be hard, but this would be super hard to clean. I, oh, well, it depends what you're drinking. Whatever to get down there? Well, you just get your sponge in there. That's oh, yes. Easy. Oh, this is also the inside, is it? Yeah, the inside's kind of You must cool. be a very beautiful person inside as well as outside. Look at this. Oh, you can't that see it, though. That could be. And this looks like the burning, Moses' burning bush. Yeah, I know. I like the way And do you, you remember? That. Passover's coming this Wednesday night. And, and for all of us, we remember that Moses was able, with the help of a... If, he had, and we could, if we had this at our Seder, we could all know that everything mm. is made out of fire. You know, everything is made out of fire. Every, you know, even clay, it's all comes from the burning fire of this the earth. This has been in the fire with the flames yes, shooting out of the kiln. So the clay gets made into this beautiful pot. Wow. This has a nice, interesting, um, almost like a question, like an the ear. like the swoop of the an handle? Ear. Yes, it's very, very Yeah, very that nice. cup came out really nice. Some of yes. them don't. I yes. lose a lot of them. Oh, wait, what do you do with stuff that doesn't come out good. Well, if it's really terrible, I, I bet smash it and oh, give it to people bad. from Mosaics. Oh, but you don't like, there's not like a fire sale. Well, I do have seconds. You have seconds? I do. I I'm sell a lot of second. seconds. I'm interested in because I am a second. I have seconds. You come to Mudflat Open Studio. And we get the studio. second. We get the seconds. You can get the seconds. Oh, I love the seconds. Yeah. Come oh, to our the, Open Studio. May My 1st. mother would love that. My mother would love that. Really? The, the flea market, seconds, right? Okay. We can get, Is your mother so we, still alive? No, no, but she would be with me when I if I'm okay. buying anything. Okay, Jeez. you'll buy her a little gift and give it to yourself. <laughs> while that would buy be cool. your deceased mother, mother a gift, gift. Right. she'd be happy I like and then that. put it on my altar i made an altar in my oh, house you did? a little altar yes oh, oh this, these would be wonderful that one would oh, be I oh that one would might be, be nice for either one this is amazing do you think amazing. this one or do you think this one which one you no this th that would this has more i i could now offend my wonderful my <laughs> wonder this has this is the, like the stuff i used to make except this is of course beautiful and graceful but this has an ashtray feel to it an ashtray feel oh my no, it's not, gosh it's not it's not a nice thing to say oh, no. I told you it was nice no. but, but but then you can trust all the other things i've said as being honest okay you see that that's the that, that's a, it's a good right. price right i said so many wonderful but the, but this is amazing and this is i mean this is, i'm not putting it down this is a beautiful <laughs> A beautiful ashtray. Beautiful but what, ashtray. What, what did you want? Is this supposed to be a bowl also? This is a bowl. I, yes. I scallop it. I call them scalloped bowls. Yeah, I'm gonna, I feel sad already. See, and they're fun to I scallop. I take it back. <laughs> this is a beautiful bowl. But they make your food taste really good. And yes. they're just really, they're pretty. And the, the glaze came out really gorgeous in this. And um, again, the deep foot. Wow. And Porcelain this, clay. Yes. And this one. And those are this little bowls. This looks like Matisse's dancers to me. Oh. Just dancing. These are really amazing. I think these are more amazing than mm. she knows, actually. This uh, is know, nice. And I really do. I, I, these are, I mean, we, we you have lucked out. <laughs> you probably didn't expect this, right? Mm. On, just the, on the, first, the first Sunday night in April, you might be the first on your block to know that you've seen a genius at work. Someone that, you know, one day, it. one day we will be hearing <laughs> and you'll say, I saw her I saw on the <laughs> Michael Coran's Be Live Aha show before, you know, no one could get to her because she was so well known. Look at this. I mean, this is, I mean, you, you can have Matisse with your, now this is very your little. Rice or your oh, you ice put a cream. little. Oh, you see, oh, a little ice cream. You I put see, a little candle instead of in eating it? it in that little that hole, which I love to do in the, in the uh -huh. container it comes in. Yeah. Oh yeah, I don't need it out of the container. Oh, this would be, but this then you'd have trouble being a, like a glutton out of this. This looks like. Well, it's very I mean, these, delicate. Yeah, they might talk back to you and say, "Who do you know? Who <laughs> how who do you who are you to eat for me? You know, are you gentle and beautiful and artistic, and lovely and exciting?" You know, what's wrong with you eating, you're eating that chocolate ice cream in here? You know, either shape up or leave us alone. It's good for chocolate ice cream. Yes. And this, these look and like doves, too. Piece, these are wild. 
I want to see the, the the series. It's like the you know, like like um, who was it that painted all the haystacks? M- uh, Manet. Oh right. Or Monet, I think Monet. Yes. And so you could see because mm. different ones, and you probably didn't intend them to be different, but they. Oh, just I did. Oh, well, you did. Oh, they're all one of a kind painting. But did you know? No, not I understood. But did yeah. you know what the what the particular difference would be? Well, I wasn't sure, but I knew that they were all yes, different. Yes, I And I love this, making yes, them all different. So this is this is natural art. This isn't. She's not intending us. She just. It just. And how do you? And you just. You paint this the same way with a brush. Well, no. With this, I do with the brush. What I do is I dip this in a clear glaze because it's porcelain. It's yeah. white. Yes. So I dip it in a clear glaze, and then I take a very fabulous brush that's made with a deer's tail. That's okay. And I dip it in wax. The deer's happy. Yes. If I was a deer, and I just go if like I, this. If I was a deer, I'd be <laughs> delighted that my tail made something like this. Now we. It's hard to believe. Time flies when we're having fun. We have only forty-five seconds to say goodbye. So well, well, if you want to see more of those, yes, you can see them at the Clever Hand Gallery in Wellesley. Also, if clever you're out hand. in Wellesley, is your hand the clever, clever hand? hand. It's, it's very clever. clever. It's yes. clever. All of us are very clever. Oh, I, did, I thought it was it's a oh. wonderful artist cooperative in Wellesley, and yeah. we all show our work there. Oh, so this at a museum? They don't even it's charge you to come, right? It's a museum. You get them for free. Totally free. Wow. Totally free. It's a okay. lovely artist co-op. You meet the artists, and so it's very the bl- special. So my last blessing is. As we eat and drink, may the good Lord bless and keep you, <laughs> whether near or eating <laughs> rice. That's it, folks. Thank you. That was one. When you hear the words mental illness, you might think of someone with depression or schizophrenia. But when you hear names like Beethoven, James Taylor, and Sheryl Crow, you probably think about creativity a music that millions of people enjoy every day. We are Tune Foolery, a group of 50 musicians affected by mental illness. Our musicians perform everything from classical to jazz, folk and rock.